Hey guys, Dan here with Vittertech, and today we're looking at setting up your Ring cameras with HomeKit using Hoobs. If you're unfamiliar with Hoobs, go back to my previous video where I unbox it, set it up, and explain how the whole thing works. Assuming you already have Hoobs set up and you have an available Ring camera, then you can begin this tutorial. So the first thing that we're going to do is go to our plugins here. We're going to hit search and search for Ring. And here you can see it here, it's the Hoobs Certified Ring plugin. We're going to hit install. And there we go, so Ring is installed. Next we're going to go to the configuration here. So there's all kinds of things here in terms of hiding specific light groups or hiding camera motion sensors or anything else that you don't want to pull into HomeKit. But for the most part, you're not going to need to worry about any of these really. You've got code here that you can customize if there's anything that you want to specifically customize. But the only thing that we really need to worry about here is the refresh token. And the way that we get this refresh token is by entering a small amount of code, which I'm going to display on the screen now. That's also going to be in the link in the description so that you can grab it yourself. And what we're going to do is hit the three dots on the top corner here and then go down to terminal. If you're familiar with SSH, you can also SSH into your Hoobs box, but for now this should be fine. So here you're going to enter the code and hit enter, and that's going to prompt you to log into Ring. In some cases you may need to do two-factor authentication, and that will generate your Ring token. Now I already have mine, so I'm not going to enter this code, but once you do, copy it to your clipboard, and we're going to navigate back to the plugin here. So hit configuration, and you want to paste your refresh token into that box there. Once you have that, we're going to hit save changes and you'll see that your bridge will stop running and it'll start again. Now you should be able to go to your groups here and see all of your ring accessories here. All of mine say front door because it's showing me all of my sensors and the buttons and everything individually. Now when I go to refresh my home, you can see here if I scroll down, I now have my front door camera. So let me know in the comments if you found this helpful or if you had any errors along the way. As always, remember to hit that subscribe button to see more tutorials like this from me as I'm gonna be going through a bunch of different plugins for Hoobs. Hit that like button because it tells YouTube that this video doesn't suck. Thanks for watching you guys and I'll see you in the next one.